okay with the glow oh girl you already know Get them, spin them, unless I'm not shooting the dentals. I put the records all in. Big man's can't bend them. Ops, we hit them. Fuck them off, we bend them. What's up, you guys? What's up, D Buzz? What's up, D Buzz? Just your girl back for another video. I say, you're wrong, wrong, wrong. Nigga, 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 wrong in the house. I say, you're wrong in the house. Watch your mouth. When I get out, jump on top. <laughs> What's up, you guys? So listen, I'm I'm ready for this. I'm ready. I'm definitely ready for this video. Okay. Oh, it took me like forever to decide on my face. It's now 2:28 in the afternoon. I've been sitting in front of the mirror since like 10 o'clock, 9 o'clock, 9:30, messing with this stupid makeup. But at the end of the day, it all came together. It came together only thanks to Kevin Aquan's face glow. Okay. Do y'all see the dewiness? Like, do y'all see the dewy? This is like a natural dew and Kevin Aquan's glass glow face. The color spectrum bronze is by all far a bomb as heck. Let me tell y'all real quick before we get into this hair tutorial. I was going to do a makeup look. I, I, I was. I was in the midst of it, but I just started looking dry. I was I was feeling drab. The lashes was not working out for me. I then said, I'm not doing this. I'm done. I'm not doing this no more today. I'm, I'm just not. We need to figure this out. I went ahead and said, but I'm just going to finish my face. Put this on, and I didn't even know how it was going to turn out. You know, I had already applied my foundation and all that stuff. This stuff right here, this illuminating, it's a wet formula, but I just put it on the back of my hand and used my damp beauty blender, okay, by Real Techniques. And honey, do you see the glow? This beat is like, this glow is everything. It gives me like that natural glow. You know, I don't like a lot of makeup, but this is it right here. It's not like one of those. You ever try those illuminators, those highlight illuminators, and they're so thick when you try to use a blending sponge with them, it becomes patchy. It's not like this. This kind of reminds me of like, like a cream. Like, you know, it just reminds me of a cream and it goes on so smooth. But look how nice it has your skin. It gives it that beautiful sheen like this stuff is like butter but i'm loving it and i think this is going to be like my everyday go-to thing you could definitely wear this without any makeup and it goes on smooth um i was gifted this by octoly and kevin aquan return for a biased review this stuff is amazing so if you're wondering why i'm glowing like this it's the kevin aquan so yes i was gifted this by octoly y'all know how i feel about sensational sensational has been my number one wig go to wig since i ever started wearing wigs love their wigs it was always their half wigs so i'm always ride or die team sensational i don't know why i do this i feel like i'm going power to the people now, also, y'all know how I feel about Elevate Styles. It's been my go-to wig website for so many years now. So, hey, what better way to do a video with Sensation now is with Elevate Styles. So, this is the Sensational Instant Up and Down. Okay, so you could do a half wig with a high bun. You could just do a high bun, a low bun, a low ponytail. Or you could just do a half wig. A half wig in here. And then there's a wraparound ponytail, girl. This one is the UD3, the Updo 3. This hair is very, very curly in texture. Very big. The color that I have is color number four. A lot of hair. So, I already had it planned out that I was going to take a few tracks out of the wig like not from the inside but i was just going to cut some of the track i don't want so much hair so i'm going to be removing some of the tracks so it looks a little bit more tamed down this is the wrap around ponytail part this is cute you can wear this alone if you wanted to this one is not the velcro one so you can just use a bobby pin and a stick on it has a small comb here ponytail is really full and that is why i have this little bun here and then I also have these braids back here because I need an anchor braid for my half wig. So the first thing I want to do is I want to remove some of the track. And I'm not going to remove too many up close. Thinking like maybe I'll remove some from the middle. So all I'm going to do, you guys, is just cut some of the hair. And the tracks, the wefts are really thin. So this should not be a problem. 
So I'm just going to gather some up. I take like two tracks or three tracks at a time because the hair is very, the tracks are real thin. And for the amount of hair that's in this wig, this little bit is definitely not going to make a difference. So if this is the first amount that I'm going to remove. So this is what it looks like now. Then I'll just go down some more, like I'll leave like some space. Just want to take out just a little bit more. Okay, so this is the last amount. I thinned out this much of the wig, okay? Now the last one that I'm going to remove is going to be like one at the bottom, only because at the nape, it's going to tangle anyway. Okay, so I could definitely feel the difference in it now. It's much more thinner, which is great. This is the top. This is the top, so it's thinned out. Yeah, so let's put the ponytail in first. Before I even begin, I did slick my hair down with Sexy Hair's wax pomade or paste, rather. This was gifted to me by Octoly. Normally, I would use the Got To Be Messifying Putty, but I wanted to try this one out. Then um, I wanted to try this one out. And on a scale of 1 to 10, I would give this one probably like a 9 um, or 10 rather because it doesn't give you like the white residue, which I like. But look at that. It gave me like a nice, like, girl, hey. I'm like feeling the glow, okay? I'm still feeling the glow. So let me put this back on until I finish putting on my ponytail. Um, I was gifted that by Octoly. I like it. This one gives you a sheen. That's the one thing I like about it. So it does go on white, but it's not as pasty white as the got to be that I showed you guys in the other video. But it goes on white and it dries really quick, but it gives you a sheen. It gives me a nice hold, so I do like that. Have this right here. The wraparound part is kind of straight. Not really so concerned about that. But here goes the comb, and hopefully I'll get this. All right, guys. So I'm just going to take the comb and put it right here dead smack in the middle. And I'm going to make sure to pull tightly and hold one side because there isn't a comb on the opposite side. And you just want to make sure you're holding it nice and tight and firm and just pull the strap or pull the hair around. You're going to need a bobby pin to place the hair, but I didn't need one with this only because part of a few pieces of the curly hair, well, I did need one. A few pieces of the curly hair got intact or stuck in with the straight, so it kind of helped to hold it. And then I just take the half wig, and I told you guys I put anchor braids, so that's, that's a good thing. It made it easier. And you're definitely gonna need some bobby pins just to pull the sides, because if you don't, It'll slip back, so you want to make sure that you take your bobby pins and put it on the side right there where you see. Okay, you guys, look. First of all, I'll see why I had to go and thin it out, okay? And could you imagine how it would have looked if I did not thin this wig out? Like, I like this curl pattern. If you don't bobby pin it on the side, it's going to kind of buckle back. That's why I put an anchor braid, because I knew it was not going to stay in my hair like that so i have like the anchor braid going all around and this is really cute though Hello. now see look it's still big and i done chopped off like ooh, drawstring i done chopped off a bunch of hair and it's still big all right but this is cute though i guess you gotta like tame it to your liking but i'm saying Hello. This is cute. Hello. Hey. With the glow. Oh, girl, you already know. Oh, honey, I am gone with the wind. Fabulous. Oh, I want to see how it looks up in a bun. See, this Kevin Aquan is definitely giving me glow. Hello. I am rhyming. I am. What, what do you know, girl? They let somebody do that. I keep it waving on do that. I'm just my nigga, I'm sick of the flu ass. That nigga came with my sister, nigga. I fucked you, man. Shoot first, you know they don't shoot back. Move like a soldier in combat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. They let somebody do that. I keep it waving on do that. I'm just my nigga, I'm sick of the flu ass. So then you gotta pull the hair over a little bit so you don't see that bandwidth. Okay, you don't want to see that bandwidth, girl. Oh, this is how you. I'm waiting till my husband come home. He'll be home in five minutes or ten. And I'm a ooh girl. Hello, hot mama Sita. This is cute, honey. That's why I freak. That's why I thinned it down because the hair would have been 
really wild. And I could still go ahead and thin some more if I really wanted to, but then it'd probably be bald headed. But oh my God, girl, girl. Give me all types of summer vibes, summer indoor vibes, okay? This one is nice. I want to try out the other one, like for real. This is cute. Okay, Elevate Styles, they always be coming through with the new, new. And Sensational's always got bomb stuff anyway. So, this is a nice ponytail because it's curly. So, girl, hello. The color number four looks cute too. I like that. that this is a cute wig. Hello. I told you guys, Sensational, stay doing the damn thing. Okay, this. Look, this wig right here, she cute, like. You definitely want this in your cart for the summer. Girl, this is cute. There are, I think there's like four of them. There is another curl, which is looser. There's a straight, and then there's a body wave. I want to try every last one of them because I love Sensational. They always come through with like the nicest nicest units half wig ponytails full wigs they always do it okay so that's why i'm always like team sensational number one supporter fan since day one the ud3 it is available at elevate styles you know what i'm saying they have the entire collection there's many different colors to choose from and you can definitely wear these separated you know you can either wear as alone as a ponytail or just a half wig oh i'm saying you guys really nice concept sensation will always be doing a damn thing when it comes to their units check out elevate styles and you want to pick up very sexy i would highly suggest this product uh, it's just styling paste it gives you sheen it doesn't make your hair hard it's not like gel this is much safer and easier to use so give it a try i will link everything below for you guys let me know what you think of the ud3 by sensational and on that note i got to go got to not do another video but i'll see you guys on the next one bye bye Get them, spin them, unless I'm not shooting the denim. I put the records on them. Big bands can't bend them. Ops, we hit them. Fuck them off, we bend them.